This is Eric Rico Scarcella down after a huge win by the Reading Phillies on Wednesday night. I'm here with our Railroad House player of the game, Cody Ashey. Cody, three for four, two home runs, four RBI, two runs scored. Uh, first player since Tim Kennelly uh, that had two home runs in a game. Uh, how to feel tonight uh, and what works? Uh, it felt good tonight. Uh, you know, everybody had good at bats up and down the lineup. Uh, you know, uh, we did a good job working the pitcher early in the game, and I think that's what wore him down. And, and I was just the one to, to cash in on, on, on the guy wearing down. And it's really credit to the to the whole lineup, you know, working that hard, uh, you know, to come out here and need a win. And, and everybody did their part tonight. Now, speaking of the lineup doing pretty well, uh, a lot of media came in, a lot of attention on this game. It was John Pettibone uh, versus Garrett Cole, the Pirates' top prospect in uh, last year's draft, uh, number one overall pick. Uh, and it looks like Pettibone came out on top. He got the win. Uh, can you speak about his performance? I know uh, he probably had the next best performance to you on the team tonight. Yeah, Pettibone uh, pitched lights out tonight. You know, any any time you can get seven solid from your starter, it, it's a good thing. And uh, you know, give credit to both guys. Both guys are really good pitchers. They're gonna go far in this game. It's it's neat to see uh, two guys face off in the minor leagues like that. Cause you know, someday they're gonna be squaring off again in the big leagues. Now uh, with Garrett Cole, he had a you know, fastball. I think I topped out about 98 miles per hour. How'd it feel to you know be standing up against that? I it, it's it's tough. You know. Garrett's a really good pitcher. You know, he, he he was drafted number one overall for a reason. You know, um, I I got a chance to face him a couple of times in college, so I was kind of familiar with with what he had. But uh, he, he's a great pitcher, and he's going to go far. Now, I spotted a little earlier today uh, during BP. You're out there working uh, third base, getting some lessons with uh, Tug Hewlett. You know, he just was came down here back from Lehigh Valley, and he's been a you know, vet, minor league veteran at third base, plus uh, roving instructor Doug Mancelino. What are they telling you? How are they helping you better adapt to the uh, the double A level? Uh, you know, they're just, they're just making minor tweaks. You know, at this point in the season, uh, you're pretty set in, in what you're going to do, but there's just little things that you might uh, develop, like a little bad habit here and there. So it's, it's good to have guys like that, that that are experienced veterans of the game and coaching that, that can spot those things out, and uh, they've been a big help to me. Once again, here with Cody Ashey. Huge night, colossal night for the guy. Two home runs. We'll send it back to RTV for tonight. Our Phil's return for a four-game series against Eastern Division foe New Britain Rock Hats tomorrow night at 7.05. Once again, have a great night, and we'll see you back at the ballpark tomorrow.